what's poppin and today i'm gonna be showing you guys how to get uh custom mac cursors on top of your macbook any macbook macbook pro macbook air imac whatever okay let's let's hop into the video so first what you're gonna do is you're gonna open up um google chrome or whatever Ever, whatever it could be safari uh, anything that you want and then you're gonna type in um well you're not really gonna type in since i already ha have it for you technically so if i quickly go to here i got this me academy this is what i do my work on yes sir and then i got this right here so i will have this link in the description down below make sure you click that not right now wait till i show you please okay so then you're going to scroll down till you see no i'm just joking till you see this right here mousecape underscore 1813 dot zip click on that it's going to be a very, very, it has literally takes up no space on your computer, so you don't got to worry about that. Then it should pop up here. Then you're going to just click that once. It's going to uh, expand Mousecape. Okay, here it is right here. You don't need this, so you can move it to the trash. And you're going to double click on Mousecape. And then this will pop up. So now you're going to click OK. Oh dang it, we can't do it, which is probably what you're thinking right now. But if you go to system preferences and you go to security and privacy and you go to general, if it's not already on general, uh, and then it should pop up right here. Mousescape was blocked from, uh, from use because it was not from an identified developer. And what you might as well do is click open anyway. This is this will not harm your computer and it will not give any viruses or anything to your computer. So then you're going to click open and you could close this out for right now. And as you can see, I already have these two things, but I'm going to show you guys how you guys can um, get a custom one that you guys want. So you're going to want to click the second link in the description, which is going to be this one, RW-Designer. Uh, and I already have one. But if I quickly go back, uh, then quickly go back, then here's the gallery. So if I go back one more time, then here's like the whole library. They, uh, they have like the most latest ones you guys can pick whatever you want from here maybe you'll want a Fortnite one maybe you want a cross one which i really like i like uh, like the cross one because i if i feels like i'm a pro so if you guys want to use this one i also have this link in the description for this one too and you're gonna want to scroll down till you see this one I'll just link the, uh, this exact one in the description. And as you can see, you're going to want to either do this uh, this one or this one. Because I don't think you guys want to have like this. I don't th think you guys are going to want to have these like little icons. So I would recommend either using this one or this one. But for uh, pr entertainment pur purposes, I'm going to use this one. So... Right when you're here, do not click download. Make sure you right click on this image and click save image as. And then wait a couple seconds. And then as you can see right here is uh, what you want and want to name it. So maybe JK Low. And then I'll save it to my desktop. Press save. And then now here, you're going to want to drag this to your desktop real quick. Then you're going to want to just leave it there just leave it there for right now now uh, now open mousecape and then uh, go on top of here and then you see all these different things but what i want you to click now is file so now you're gonna click a new cape right here click on it right click and then click edit when you're here you're gonna click this plus sign right here then you're going to click on this, uh, what it's called, and you're going to call this arrow. Then don't change anything yet. You're going to want to go to your desktop, and you see your images. 
go to your um, go to your desktop. Make sure it's saved on your desktop so you can drag it easier. All right, and then you're just gonna want to drag it from here to one X. Wouldn't recommend putting it in anything else, but I would recommend one X. And then as you can see, there's a dot right here. So the hot spot. So maybe try 20, 21, 22, 23. That's perfect. And now I'll do 20 again. And now 21, and 22, and 23. That's perfect. Uh, let me probably scooch it over a little bit. And that's perfect. Okay, now, if you guys want to change the size uh, of this exact one that I'm using right now, put 39. Uh, if you're using the one that I'm using, I would recommend like 39 and 39. But I like the one that I have now, so I'm not going to change it from this. I'll just do it for, like, uh, entertainment purposes. Okay, there we go. So now uh, do something that will fit, uh, fit you best. Then now you're going to click the X right here, and you're going to click Save. There we go. Now you're done with that. Now to get it, you either right-click and press Apply, or you double-click on it, and you should have it. Just do double-click. Eh. It doesn't usually work uh, if you have another one on, but as you can see, it just worked. It's really cool. And one more thing. If you do want a colored one, you may have to edit it in like an editor or something. Or you could just type in, if they have it, maybe like red. Wait. Maybe like red cross. Like here. Red cross. And you may be able to find it. A uh, red cross right here. Okay. And you're just going to right click, save image as. And then save it to desktop, click save. Drag it to your desktop. And then just repeat the same process if you want to do it again. New cape, edit. Plus, click, drag this to here. It, this one is a little weird, but I'll just show you like what it looks like. I'm not going to really use it, but I'll just show you what it looks like. Well, it's being odd since I already have three, but I hope you guys enjoyed this banger video. Like and subscribe for more stuff like this, more tutorials that will definitely help you guys out. And peace out. It's Vaz, and I'm out.